became a fighter pilot, a fighter ace actually, in two wars. He flew the, some of this is repetitive. <laughs> Um, he flew the P-47 Thunderbolt, accumulating 28 victories in the European theater of World War II. During the Korean conflict, he flew the Sabre Jet, scoring another six and a half combat victories. During an interview in 1944, when my dad was just 25 years old, he was asked about his score of victories, and he responded by saying, quote, whether a fellow has two, 10, or 28 isn't important. We all do our job as well as we can, end of quote. This is how my father lived. While, while flying his last combat mission over Germany, Gabby successfully made a pass at grounded enemy aircraft and decided to make a second pass when his propeller hit the tarmac and was damaged, leaving, leaving him no choice other than landing the plane in German territory. He was captured and was a prisoner for the remainder of the war. Shortly after his return to the States, on June 11, 1945, my parents were married and had nine wonderful children. <laughs> on May 19th of this year, the Congressional Gold Medal was awarded to all the American fighter aces from all wars. This elite group is comprised of 1,447 air aces out of more than 60,000 pilots. I was proud to attend the ceremony which took place at the U.S. Capitol. The medal is placed in the Smithsonian Air and Space Museum in Washington, D.C. It was a moving experience to hear the stories that were shared among the many pilots who attended. I'm so proud of being part of his legacy that fought so hard to preserve our freedom. And again, thanks to the Creative Aviation for honoring my father.